people in your household? Throughout the pandemic, CARES in Farmington Hills has been feeding the hungry their food okay. pantry, shifting to drive up curbside service to care for the thousands of people in need in the surrounding areas. Now the building, which was once a church, has been renovated thanks to grant money and the family pantry is back inside with a big grand reopening this Sunday. There's never a dull moment. If you want to come here and rest, there's no rest. But it's fun. It's fun to be here. Kitty Ostash says it's a campus that serves more than 500 families each month for free here at the family pantry. There's also a Bush's Cares Market, which is a small grocery store for the community where anyone can shop, but guests with a bridge card get 10% off. Families are so appreciative and they come in and they're delighted. They're in a, they're just so grateful. There's dignity shopping here in the family market. Between the pandemic and rising inflation, so many people just need a little help. This family pantry, not only full of food, but from diapers to deodorant, they're trying to make sure people have access to whatever they need. Who'd have thought that people in Farmington, Farmington Hills, they wouldn't think that they needed assistance, but you do. We all do. Which is why they serve people from Livonia, Farmington, Farmington Hills, Novi, Northville, parts of West Bloomfield, Redford, and Southfield. Donations from schools and churches and restaurants, together with the volunteers, make it all possible. And we love our volunteers. We couldn't do it without the volunteers that we have here. And now everyone is invited to Sunday's grand reopening, an open house to celebrate all that CARES has to offer, and there's much more to come, with a former convent being converted to provide social services and the grounds being transformed into a place of reflection for the community. This is our campus of hope. So what you're seeing here by feeding people is so important. To RSVP for Sunday's open house, to learn more about services, donations, and volunteering, log on to caresfh.com. In Farmington Hills, Amy Lang, Fox 2 News.